And you can feel the eel already, I feel. Oh my gosh, it's a monster sea bass. Yo, Net. That's the biggest sea bass I've ever seen. Yeah. Good morning, everybody. Tyler Deck here. Hey, I am headed down to Point Pleasant, New Jersey this morning for my, technically my second fishing trip of the season. Gonna head out front. We're going out on the Dauntless this morning. Buddy Steve is supposed to come with me, but he had a late night at work, so it's just me this morning. We're gonna head out for some sea bass, ling, that's pretty much it, but uh, fluke. Maybe there's some winter fly on or maybe there's a striper around. Who knows? It's going to be a great morning. The sun's coming up. Hey, one more thing I want to mention real quick, guys. I've always used fluorocarbon tied rigs, and I think they're far superior to monofilament tied rigs. Um, but I have trouble finding where they where you can buy them pre-made. So I have gone ahead and made my own, and I am selling my own 100% fluorocarbon rigs. Go ahead and head on over to thefrugalfisherman.com. The word the, the word frugal, the word fisherman, thefrugalfisherman.com, and go ahead and get yourself some hand-tied rigs, 100% fluorocarbon, hand-tied by yours truly. I'll add some jigs and some other products here in the next coming months. But for right now, go ahead and grab some of these. I won't talk too much more. I'll meet you guys out on the boat. No, he got it. I'll get the nasty. It is time. Boy, you better get in there. That'll go. All right. This go. This goes right. Yeah. What is that? Yeah, there's not a wiggle to that. And lifting up a car tire. Is it just a decent double? Yeah. All right, foul hooked a decent one. Yeah, I was going to say, I guess that counts, right? Yeah. Awesome. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll go there. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. On the side, okay. Just, yeah, I guess okay. uh, anyway, it works, right? Yeah. Wasn't the plan, but, huh. Yeah. So, as you guys might have noticed, the boat was absolutely packed today. Uh, I think all the rod spots were taken on both sides. So there were definitely a couple tangles that happened throughout the boat. Uh, but here, uh, I got tangled up with somebody on the other side. The mate came over. Ended up having to cut my line. And the sign of a good mate, he helped me out and uh, tied my leader right back on and got me back in the action. These guys were awesome. He's yeah, a man. Thank you very much. I'm sorry, your name is? Justin. Justin. Really appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hands wet. My first ling. <laughs> As I bring over everybody's stuff. All right. Okay. On the bucktail, yeah. On the bucktail. Yeah. So after losing a couple bucktails and only having that one ling to show for it, I broke out another Frugal Fisherman high-low rig that you guys can pick up at thefrugalfisherman.com. All 100% fluorocarbon, guys. I tipped it with some clams. And let's see how I do. There we go. 
That one might be good. I think that's good. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. We looking better. We looking better. All right. Fresh bait was the key to that, everybody. Fresh bait was the key to that. All right. Oh yeah. Doing this backwards, but it's fine. Yep. We gotta get there. Yeah. every time although oh this, this feels too big you know what I mean <sighs> feels very tire like <sighs> you can feel the eel already I feel like <sighs> Oh my gosh, it's a monster sea bass. Yo, net. Oh, big, big, big. Net. That's the biggest sea bass I've ever seen. Yeah. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. What do we think that weighs? Thank you. <laughs> yeah, what do what do we think that weighs? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, it's four. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I'm gonna keep this goofy thing on my head if that's all right. Wow. Let's go ahead and give it up right now. Thanks, man. Wow. Wow. That's a. That's a monster. True. Wow. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. All right, buddy. Let's put you to sleep. Oh, man. There we go. Think we could get that lucky? So as you guys might have noticed, it's about midday now and the wind definitely died for a little while and it was a little weird and our drift got a little goofy, but there were still some fish around and it definitely started to heat up. Double, that's why. I was gonna say one might be good. Yeah, it is, yeah. I think he's short. I think he's the. Thank you, 
short too. Yep. Pick through the little ones to get to the big ones, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, I did too. Yeah. Oh, I think he'll go. Oh, I think he'll go. <laughs> That guy's good, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'll check him all day, right? He's good. Oh, awesome. I got the the guy who didn't bring a cooler. All right. Nine fish. That is the day. you around or should I meet you back here? Yeah, whatever you want. Oh, you know what? Fish pull down this way. turned out to be a banner day out on the Dauntless. Man, we got in on the fish quick. There was a little lull and we got back in them. A big shout out to the crew. A big apology for my tip snafu. They'll know exactly what I'm talking about. So sorry for that, guys. Um, shout out to the captain. He got us out there. He got us on some fish and stayed out late. So if you guys head out on the Dauntless, which you absolutely should, uh, expect to come back a little bit later than planned. Uh, but it's all good. The fishing was great. Uh, so big thank you to everybody. Don't forget to check out thefrugalfisherman.com for those rigs. They worked great today. A fluorocarbon line is just perfect. Uh, go ahead and check me out on Instagram. It's at the underscore frugal underscore fisherman. And uh, you know what, guys? Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one.